All right, here we have our uh, metallic green, uh, emerald green 95 Ford Bronco 4x4. It's got the 5.8 uh, V8 with the uh, automatic overdrive transmission. Uh, it's always a Northwest truck. There's no rust anywhere on this truck. It's almost all original paint, probably about 85%. Uh, it's got a ton of stuff to be done to it. We went through, did a tune-up on it, um, put a new coil in it, tires, uh, fresh oil change. Uh, beautiful looking body. It's got the polished aluminum Alcoa wheels with the fully loaded XLT trim package. You can see there. Really clean body. I mean, you can just see the reflection of me in there. You can pretty much see me perfectly. There's a couple little nicks there. They're not real deep. There's no, you can't really get an edge on them. Nice looking rockers. And you can see all the uh, underside pictures too. To show how rust free this thing is. This is the only panel that I think has been repainted. I don't think it's uh, been repainted all the way through. But I could, I just go by it because I could see um, some little, looks like sanding scratches maybe there. Um, and right here too. You can obviously see it. There you go. But uh, it's the only panel that. Uh, I've looked this thing top and bottom that's been repainted. Uh, it's I do have the spare tire for it. I just took it off so it doesn't hide any the body. And you can see it's not dented in at all from uh, spare tire getting out of control. Has a little bit of scratching going on there. Which is pretty standard. And then uh, there's no rust at all in here. I mean, even in here, I mean, this is, it hasn't been all detailed up. You know, of course, we vacuumed it out and cleaned it up and gave it a coat of wax. But, uh, you know, just really nice condition. Go ahead and put that up and away there for you. The bumper's not all banged up. On the driver's side, and on the whole body, this is the only, you can see it's just slightly dented in. I don't know what it's from, and it chipped the paint a little bit. But just really nice body. The top has never been off. Oh, it's got a little scratch there, and then also here by the uh, door knob, the door lock. That's got these small uh, XLT mirrors, which are nice, and they're, those are both power. So it's nice to have the power mirrors. Just really clean, and, and there's a little kind of a weird mark on the hood, real, this real small spot, and it's also towards the driver's uh, edge. Uh, sometimes I have a hard time finding it. But it's uh, it's pretty faint, but it has a little does a little mark. The front of the hood is in nice condition; doesn't have any major chipping, um, so I may have had a bug guard on it at one time that prevented it. But uh, even down here, it just has a couple little chips. Uh, the grill, all the trim, and all the glass is in good condition; no cracks. Uh, there's just a, uh, I think so. The front window I think's been replaced at one point because it doesn't have the original Ford markings. It's got the tan interior. You know, of course, you know, as it falls through, there's no rust anywhere. The driver's seat has a little bit of wearing there. And the, uh, has this, you know, these are not broken. A lot of these get hammered on and get broken. They go up nice and smooth. Um, it's got a CD changer in here and then the tape deck up here, Pioneer unit. And then amazingly, it still has these. You look a lot of these center consoles, how those things missing. Um, nice looking carpet. It's got the, uh, touch button four-wheel drive system that works perfectly. There's a little bit of darkening, you know, probably from somebody's heel or something. Good looking back seat. And uh, the carpet looks really good too. And you can see all the trim panels. Uh, the top's never been off. Uh, it's a non-smoker, so the headliner's in really good condition. Go ahead and go to the engine. We'll fire this up. It's got 174,000 miles. And it's the 5.8. So it's got, you know, quite a bit more power than the uh, 5, two, five or the five liter or the 302, which is still a great motor, though. Nice running, nice and smooth. The alternator's been also been replaced by the previous owner, not by me, uh, along with the battery. And underneath the hood is in nice condition. No signs of uh, overheating or uh, all the panels are original. Never been. Uh, in, you know in the accident and you can see we leave the motor nice and honest you know it's a little greasy it's a little dirty but that's what you're gonna get you know at a vehicle this age but it's still for the year very clean condition as you can see on the underneath of the body so that is our 95 Bronco uh, we're gonna run no reserve on this so high bidder will win on a seven-day auction 
and please watch our other video for the uh, driving and uh, good luck to everybody.